Nick. This is Eddie. We are here, uh, if I am correct, for the first time ever in Review the World History. We are actually filming by the Butler County Regional Airport. That's right. And me and Brian, we've taken late night walks by here. We've yeah. By here, but it's actually it's kind of hard to get a chance to get up here. But luckily for us, there's a car show going on down the road. Yeah, we know, actually so. were in route to a different place and hit a roadblock, and it appears there is a, a car show. Now in my hands I've got uh, I got Ruffles cheese fr uh, crispy fries, uh, cheese flavored. I guess it's kind of like if you ever have potato sticks, anything like that. Uh, no, they're actually like a thicker. You can smell that like cheesy, zesty, um, typical flavor. Uh, Makes me wish I had some ketchup for barbecue. Oh, shit. but but I think or you need to I think you need to let Nick. I mean, uh, sorry, uh, Ed, know that these are past due. Yes, <laughs> yes, these did. These did expire back in November because of yeah, last year. Uh, uh, of last year. <laughs> November of last year. Hey, you know, hey, with Review hey. the World, there are plenty of times where we buy stuff and we try to film, but you know, months go by yeah. and we can't do anything. But high risk, low reward. It's still good. Yeah. I dig it. It's fresh. Still needs ketchup. Still needs barbecue sauce. Maybe a little salt. Even though it says nothing about it. If you didn't know any better, it's it's just like eating the ruffle sour cream and uh, cheddar uh, chips. Yeah, but it's not so uh, strong of a sour cream flavor. Yeah. It's there, but it's not like in your face sour cream. Well, I think we should let Ryan try. I agree. Like Norrin Rad, the Silver Sword for a galactic uh, traveler, I have found my way here to this. Uh, Nondescript alley to try these. The guys already did a fun introduction to them. I'm simply here to let them tantalize my taste buds. An interesting anecdote is that I actually bought something very similar to these from Nathan's, you know, Nathan's hot dogs. They kind of do a double review, and I tried those on my own, and uh, they were terrible. Super dry, cardboard, just not good at all. Um, these are pretty good though, even though that these are expired by a nice chunk of time. Apologies for the wind, guys. Um, these are not bad. The seasoning's good. I'm imagining if we ate these before they expired, they would be much fresher. Um, overall, though, pretty good. I think they also came in another flavor, maybe barbecue. It's original, actually. Just oh, original. Okay. Uh, I, yeah. Which, I've, I tried the original, too. The, the original were, were, were pretty good, but... No, not much to write home about. Nick, you're watching your view for us. Hey everybody, so, this is uh, Nick here. Eddie here. Now, one thing me and Nick have in common is like our burgers plan. We got these uh, burger gums, the way that they're described here in these pictures. It looks like they got a uh, LTO. I wonder what that tastes like as a chewing gum, Nick. Well, it does say it's got a ketchup like liquid uh, filling. And me and you uh, both love ketchup. Yeah, uh, I'm not a fan at all. <laughs> oh, I thought you did love it. No. He what likes to play. Mustard, then? Nothing. Oh, shit. bacon. This guy likes to play it. Bacon. I've been wrong. Geez. All these years, I've been wrong. Right, he does well, like the viscosity uh, of ketchup. You might hold on to this room. So I'll hold on to it. And they've each, you know, they're not, they're not individually wrapped. Like, and nicely, you know, printed. That's maybe, maybe I'll save these if we don't like them and uh, give them to the kids at uh, trick or treat oh, wow. next year. This doesn't That's... really look like a burger. It kind of looks like Crank from the old Ninja Turtles cartoon. It, <laughs> it doesn't really look like gum either. Wow. It looks more just like a plastic burger toy. Nick, can you maybe bite yours in half so we can see the uh, mysterious ketchup? Oh my god. Yeah, it looks like a jelly donut, man. That was awesome. Ketchup has a slight cherry taste. Yeah. Kind of reminds me of fake blood mm -hmm. on Halloween. Man, I tell you what, you know what I think about these? They are, they're not bad. They're pretty nice. I think these. Slam dunk. You know what I think? I think Alaska burger. It's for you, Alaska. 
All right, when I saw this on the store shelf, it sung to me. I immediately had to have it. And uh, Nick and Eddie did an excellent job, very eloquent, to describe what it is. Um, so I'm simply just going to try it, and you'll get my reaction. You know, Allen Ginsberg, Jack Kerouac, the beat writers, their uh, motto was fir first thought, best thought. And so you're going to get my first thought here. Mmm. This is good. I think, for one, it's adorable. It's an awesome creative gimmick, so pat them on the back for that. Whoever was in the marketing, you know, boardroom, excellent. Job well done, kudos. Flavor-wise, delicious, great gum. Everything about this is fun. Very summer-centric. Certainly if I was a kid, I would love these. So all around, thumbs up. Speaking about being a kid, man, I'm just gonna go play. Man, 